morning, everyone. I'm Kim Lemon. And I'm Ron Martin. The state says it's going to fine Harrisburg for its leaking trash trucks. New State's Harrisburg reporter Portia Johnson found out what leaked and when. Every day, the city's trash trucks are on the streets. The Public Works Director, Aaron Johnson, says two of them have been leaking dirty water from the compacted trash. Councilwoman Sandra Reed says sometimes the trucks get damaged during their route. Um, I know that one truck, when they picked up a dumpster, actually, when they went to dump the dumpster, it actually punched a hole in, in the bed of the truck. So sometimes, you know, periodically this, these things happen. The Department of Environmental Protection says during an inspection, it discovered two leaking trucks. It issued these violation notices to the city. DEP says the concern is the dirty water could have gotten into the stormwater system. It probably was leaking along the streets, but they're getting them repaired. The public works director told News 8, quote, I'm not 100% sure if that happened or not. It concerns me big time. He goes on to say, when we don't have the resources to do these things, it's frustrating. We have an aging infrastructure. We have an aging fleet. And we understand that, and our Senate, our public works director is working very hard at making sure that the repairs are made in a timely fashion to the vehicles. The public works director says thanks to Grayville equipment and repair, the city was able to get the trucks fixed now and pay for it later. Reed says council will be voting to allocate $30,000 for the repairs. We're doing the best that we can. You know, we have to still collect the trash on a regular basis in the city. In Harrisburg, Portia Johnson, News 8. Tonight at 6.30, City Council is voting to allocate money for the trash truck repairs. The DEP says it has notified the city of the amount of the fine, but it has not yet notified them of the fine, but it should do so in the next week or two. 